Good morning, you guys, and how's it going? I am back with another Sims for Owls build. And as you can tell by the title, this is called Rolling Hills. And I called it that um, because I am writing, like, I don't know if it's, it's probably a book. Or, yeah, well, it's, yeah, it's a book. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I'm writing a book. Um, I don't know that it would ever get published or anything. I'm not an author or anything like that. Um, it's just... Um, it's the story of um, a past relationship that I had, and it was a bad one. And I'm telling my story. So I'm kind of starting from the very beginning of how he and I met and all the things that followed through that and it's going to be, it's going to be like probably one of the, it's going to start out as like one of the best love stories but it's going to turn into the worst and then the ending um, will be fictional because it's not true. I just, I needed to have some sort of ending, so the, probably the last half of the book will probably be, well, I don't know how much of the ending, will, not how much of the ending, but I don't know at what point that's going to stop being mostly true. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm pretty excited about it, I just started writing it. I'm not even through the first chapter yet, so it's still in extremely early stages, and I'm pretty happy with it so far. Um, I'm gonna make a lot of tweaks, and I'm not gonna use real names, and it's it's gonna be fun to write, I think. Um, so yeah, um, the two sims that you can see right now um, are two uh, characters from my uh, book. And uh, one of them is kind of me, and the other one is the um, fictional guy that you guys will meet at the end. <laughs> um, his name is Rowan, and I used um, not my real first name, but I used my middle name. So it's Taylor and Rowan, and I did not put them on the gallery. Um, I just didn't really want to. But I can if you guys would like me to. Um, that's not a problem. They're still on my library, on my uh, Sims gallery profile page, whatever. So I think I can still upload them. Um, but yeah, if you guys would like me to upload them to the gallery, I definitely can. So just let me know. Um, so this house um, was mostly inspired by a house that I um, see every time. Not every time, but I see it every so often, and it's like, it's so pretty, and I, I love it so much. So, um, it's mostly based off that house of that I just adore. It's, it's that blue color, and it has that curved roof in the front, and there's a whole bunch of landscaping, and it's just so pretty. And the street it's on is gorgeous in the fall, because, um... All the trees overlap over the street so it's just like this canopy of trees and when it's fall you know you can imagine that it. it's just like this colorful beautifulness and it's just so pretty um, I love it um, but yeah so that's where the house got inspired by and I think it turned out pretty good for the most part um, the layout's kind of weird I thought um, I didn't, I kind of made it funky, but that's okay. It turned out, it turned out pretty good. And I also want to say that I completely forgot to put a dining room table in there, so you guys will have to do that, I'm sorry. Um, there's one other thing that I had forgotten to do, but I did it while I was still in build mode. I don't remember what that was. But yeah, so this is like a two bedroom, oh! I remember now. <laughs> I had forgotten to put stairs. You will see throughout this video that there is no stairs. 
Um, but I think that I added them in off camera, so you'll you'll see stairs eventually. But uh, I didn't realize that until a little bit later, so I had to rearrange um, the area where I put the fish tank. You don't see the fish tank isn't up yet, obviously, but um, you'll see where I made that change later. Um, I have been trying to like experiment with different colors in The Sims because I found that I'm using a lot of like neutral colors and stuff that just goes together um, because I'm I really like clean looking stuff like. I love like modern, contemporary, rustic. It's like a mixture of all that. But I also love like um, bohemian and stuff and colorful things. And it, I, I just like a mixture of stuff. And it's hard to make mix it all together. And I found that I have a hard time mixing different colors together that I think mine might not go together but they actually do um, in that weird perfect kind of way so I've been like really struggling to try and make different um, house or did not not different house colors but different like color palettes for the houses I do because I am noticing that <laughs> um, I do like the same neutral colors and I use this tile for the bathroom all the time and it's just, <laughs> cause it's just like a neutral, easy color to use. And I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm getting sick of using it myself, and I'm sure you guys are sick of seeing me use it. So, um, yeah. Um, so the upstairs is pretty darn small, as you can see. I could barely fit two rooms up there. Um, it's just the this master bedroom and a. Uh, a bathroom. Sorry uh, about the yawning. Uh, as you guys know, I've talked about it in the past, but if you knew here, I was having um, back and abdominal pain at the same time. So I've been going to the doctor a lot and I've been getting tests done. And long story short, um, I have a gallstone, but it, my gallbladder is functioning fine, even though it's kind of slow. and um, they still don't really know why I'm having pain at random, so, yeah. Uh, so I had pain last night and I had to take a, uh, um, pain pill for it. So I slept in pretty late this morning, which is unusual for me, but, um, I took it at, like, 2 a.m., something like that, but, yeah. Anyway, so the video is almost done here. The screenshots are coming up pretty soon, so I'm going to cut it off right here. I hope you guys enjoyed today's build. I'm so sorry it's late, so um, hopefully it'll be, it should be on time on Friday, but if not, I'll let you guys know. Anyway, I <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed today's build, um, so like, comment, and subscribe for weekly sensor videos, and I will see you guys all on Friday. Bye!